Hello there, YouTube. It's playing games every day here, and uh, right now I am trying to find the safest way home because for some reason creeps are still alive at this point. I've got to get back to my half ass blown up tree fort thing that I made a couple of days ago, and uh, so yeah, that's what I'm doing. I hope everyone out there is doing well better than me anyway right now I am I am tired boy am I tired and I'm just I'm wore out and man you know what really really sucks ooh arrows I can do nothing with those as of right now but um uh today I had to go to the doctor and get like f sh oh my god is that gonna be in every one of my videos I had to go to the doctor and get shots Lots of shots. I had to get like seven shots, I think. Four in one arm, then uh, five in the other. Or, I'm sorry, no. Three in the other. I'm sorry, I'm just so... Boy, was it. I'm applying for college and... Ooh, he is mad. Oh, he is really mad. Got him. Yeah! But yeah, I'm getting ready to apply for colleges, and uh, had to get my shot record, which apparently I was missing like seven, seven shots that I have not done. So I had to get those. Hey, Piggy Piggy, how are you? Not so good, I bet. Not so good. Yeah, that's right. You run away. You run away. I said run. And uh, so yeah, had to get seven shots. It was horrible. A actually, it wasn't that bad. The, the lady who did it was pretty nice. And, uh, and all that whatnot. Today, I think I'm going to expand. I'm going to expand my house into this. I'm going to make a pool. I feel like having a pool in my house, and I think that's what I will do. As soon as I can. Stupid floating snow. Yeah. Okay. So, I'm going to begin building my pool for me to bathe in and pool around. I have no idea where I'm going with the series whatsoever. I just wanna, I just wanna do things in Minecraft. You know what? I'm gonna work on my pool, and then, uh, and then I will start recording yet again. Well, uh, here, I don't have much progress on my pool. I didn't, I didn't really do a lot, but uh, I figured now was a really good time to talk to you guys about something about my experiences today at the doctor, which was it was quite less than awkward. Or quite more than awkward. I'm. I'm sorry. Uh, it was. It was actually horrible. Um, so I went in there, and the nurse was this was this nice female black lady, and I don't mean to bring race in this, but I, I just figured I'd give you a better picture of what she might look like. And uh, she's really nice, you know. It's just just real, just a just a nice person. And uh, the doctor was this about seventy year old looking woman. Maybe younger. I'm really bad with age, but look just like my grandmother, and she asked me a series of awkward questions. Just uh, um, not only did I have to get shots for my college applications, I had to get a uh, an actual physical. And uh, that was did anybody anyway. I had to get an actual physical, where they proceeded to pull my pants down, bat my junk around, and. And asked me, shut up, I am making a video. Anyway, back to them batting my junk around. So they proceeded to just kind of slap my slap my junk around. And uh, asked me if I was sexually active. And You know, for some people that's not really awkward to talk about. But I was just like, well, yes I am. And she's like, she took it so well. I don't know if any of you have ever been in the position that I was in. But, I mean, it's not like I was there with my parents. I was there on my own. And, uh, so she's just like, so are you sexually active? And I was just like, yeah, a little. <laughs> she's just like, well, okay, just make sure you use protection, I hope, and blah, 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 and have a nice day. And I was just like, cool. And she's like, there hasn't been any, uh, seepage, has there? I'm like, uh, no. If you're trying to get at the fact that I might have a venereal disease, you're traveling up the wrong path here. So, uh, but yeah, she was surprisingly cool about it. I 
I guess she's dealt with other teenagers and is used to the whole kids are gonna do what they do, you know? And, I mean, I guess she'd also, she didn't seem like the lady to judge, but it was just so awkward talking to this woman that looked just like my grandmother. Like, it was surprising how mirrored she looked towards my grandmother. And that was, that's what made it really awkward for me, I guess. It wasn't the actual fact that I was being asked whether or not I've had sex by some old lady. It was just the fact that, that it was by someone that looked familiar. Which, I, it, it makes it about 17 times more awkward than it normally would for me. That's just, but that's just me, I guess. I mean, what are some of the awkward situations that any of you have been in, assuming that that uh you've been in some ridiculously awkward situations I mean, oh crap it's getting nighttime again damn it that looks like there's something cool over there i'll probably be heading over there tomorrow uh but anyway like i was saying so not only was this ridiculously awkward for me it was just it was just ridiculously awkward for me but i answered it with a smile so who knows if that's anything that uh had to do with it. God, I don't even know what I'm saying. I'm just so tired and Oh god. So anyway, uh just just post some sort of awkward situation that you've been in. I really enjoy uh enjoy hearing other people's experiences more than I do talking about my own. Other people have much more interesting things to say than I do usually. So, uh, yeah.